f of x equals negative 5 x squared. It is negative 5 times x to the power of 2. f of x equals negative 5 x squared. Find f of 0, f of 1, f of negative 1, f of 2, f of negative 2. We are asked for the value of the function at x equals 0. That means what? We replace x with 0. So negative 5 times x squared. Some students confuse this with negative 5x and then squared. This is no, no. It is negative 5 times x to the power of 2. It is negative 5 times x to the power of 2. So let's do that. Negative 5 x squared. So at the position of the x, we substitute 0. So we have negative 5 at the position of the x, we substitute 0. And what is 0 times 0? So this is negative 5 times 0. And that is 0 times anything is 0. So negative 5 times 0, and that is equal to 0. So what is our point? Our point is x comes first. When x equals 0, y is equal to 0. What is the function? Function is negative 5x squared. Now we are asked for the value of the function at x equals 1. So don't forget our f of x equals negative 5x squared. And we rewrite it as, to avoid confusion, we, write, we rewrite it as negative 5x squared. So what is this? Negative 5 at the position of the x. What do we substitute? At the position of the x, we substitute 1. And what is 1 squared? So this is negative 5 times 1. 1 squared is 1, right? So negative 5 times 1, so it is negative 5. So what is our point? Our point is 1 negative 5. And what is the function? Our function is negative 5 times x to the power of 2. Let's look at what is the value of the function at x equals negative 1. Let's again start with f of x equals negative 5 x squared. We rewrite it as negative 5. At the position of the x, we put a blue ink. All right. So this is negative 5 at the position of the x. What do we have? Negative 1. So we substitute negative 1 to the power of 2. So we have negative 5. And then at the position of negative 1 to the power of 2, we have 1. Because negative 1 times negative 1 is 1. So what is negative 5 times 1, negative 5. So what is our point? The point on the graph is negative 1, x equals negative 1, y equals negative 5. All right, what is our function? Our function is negative 5 times x squared. What is the value of the function at x equals 2? Again, we start with f of x equals negative 5 x squared. So we put a different color ink for x. And then at the position of the x, what do we substitute? 2. So we put 2 there. And so this is negative 5 times 4. And that is negative 20. So what is our point? Our point is 2, negative 20. 20. What is the function? Our function is negative 5 times x squared. Now let us evaluate the function at x equals negative 2. Again, we start with f of x equals negative 5 x squared. So we put negative 5 as before, but for x we use a different ink. 
So you get negative 5. What is x? x at the position of the x, we have what is negative 2 times negative 2? It is positive 4. So this is again negative 20. Negative 5 times 4 is negative 20. So what is our point? Our point is negative 2, when x equals negative 2, y equals negative 20. x equals negative 2, y equals negative 20. And what is our function? Negative 5 times x squared. So let's recap everything that we have learned so far. When we substitute x equals 0, we get 0. So what is our point? 0, 0. And what is our function? Negative 5x squared. When x equals 1, we substitute 1. And what do we get? Negative 5. When x equals 1, y equals negative 5. So what is our point? 1, negative 5. What is our function? negative 5, y is equal to negative 5, x squared, negative 5 times x to the power of 2. What is the value of the function at x equals negative 1? When we substitute x equals negative 1, we get negative 5. When x equals negative 1, y equals negative 5. And that is our point, and that is our function. When x equals 2, our point is 2, negative 20. And what is our function? negative 5, y is equal to negative 5 times x to the power of 2. What is the value of the function when x equals negative 2? Substitute x equals negative 2 into negative 5 times x squared. And what do we get? Negative 2, negative 20. And what is our function? Negative 5, y is equal to negative 5, x squared. So when we put all these, we get 0, 0, 1, negative 5, 2, negative 20, negative 1, negative 5, and negative 2, negative 20. What is the input? When input is 0, what is the output? 0. When input is 1, what is the output? Negative 5. When input is 2, what is the output? Negative 20. When input is negative 1, what is the output? Negative 5. When negative 2 is the input, what is the output? Negative 20. 0, 1, 2, negative 1, negative 2. Those are all members of the domain. What about the range? 0, negative 5, negative 20, negative 5, negative 20. And we have the ordered pair. So now you can plot the graph. And this is George Matthew signing off. Good luck.